We are down in Texas this weekend for the President's Cup event that the local club puts on. I just finished up three loops of five sections in the morning. Pretty short day, pretty easy sections, but still some fun. And now Tana's turn to go ride her section, so we'll see how she does. You just finished up your first eight sections. How'd they go? Went pretty well. I cleaned up as the day went on. I had some pro trouble with some tricky corners and some steep ups, but I can't wait to see what the exhibition will bring. much fun. I actually like getting challenged and going up over those steep and down the, down the steep, I should say down the steep and up the steep. Now that's what got me. I ended up doing almost a full-blown backflip in the last section, but I came out and I did a nice little stance just like that. <laughs> yeah. Did you learn anything? Yeah, timing, timing, and not, not waiting the bike. I did not wait the bike properly. But I did shock myself in the last section. I sat there and I balanced between the two bumps in the dirt, and I think that's what threw me off, and then I forgot to wait the front end, and that's what caused me to do the backflip. And then what about, you had two fives for rolling back. How do you fix that? Uh, using the brake or popping the clutch. Or slip the clutch to or hold slip, yourself slip on, the clutch. on a hill. Instead of rolling back, you can slip the clutch and hold yourself there and use the brakes as well. But overall, good job, it was fun to watch. Definitely made it exciting, and there's more tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes. I'm excited. <laughs> it is day two out here at Red River, and they switched the schedule up to where the lower classes ride in the morning and the higher classes in the afternoon. So Hannah's gonna start things off today. She's hurting a little bit, has a bit of a wrist issue, but hopefully it's only five sections, she can ride strong and finish with a smile. So we'll see how it goes, see what happens, and I'm looking forward to riding some harder sections in the afternoon. Talk about a mental battle today. My wrist got in my mind big time. All those drops, it hurt like heck, but I also let it take control of my riding and I ended up making a bunch of mistakes, which I knew I probably could at least got two, maybe, maybe cleaned a few of them, but the mental battle was huge. Yesterday was a lot more fun. Today, it was fun, but Towards the last part of it, it was I, I ended with a clean, and that's what matters. Nice and smooth, just keep it rolling.
just finished up our normal eight sections of three loops and once again the sections were really easy they might be a little bit boring to watch but i figured i would put some in film a little bit of the daytime section so people could get an idea of what the master lines look like here in case they want to come down and ride an event now we are heading into the exhibition sections i don't have any points yet pretty sure our spanish visitor are now does not have any either so hopefully we get some hard sections and see who wins Well, the exhibition was pretty fun the sections again were easy but they were set up pretty well for the master class it was cool to ride with those guys and see some of the kids ride some harder lines and also get some experience riding in front of a crowd having all the other riders around and putting pressure on you definitely has a different feel so it's good for those guys to get that experience at the local level not many events have that atmosphere so it's definitely cool that they do that our now and i kept it clean until the end and then we tried to do a bit of a ride off he picked three lines that we both hit and cleaned those as well but we were running out of daylight, so we had to set a lot of time. Overall, it was a good event, and I'm glad we came down to do it. And I definitely got more out of it than I did, but sometimes it's just how it goes. It was still a good time riding with the Texas Club.